Hey guys, so we all have fears, right? I think that's pretty obvious. Though some people like to pretend like we don't have fears. I mean, come on. You could have a fear of... The dark? Or, you could have a fear of... Fire. What the heck, you guys? Stop turning off the lights! Or, you could have a fear of... Gosh, what is up with him? Why are you guys even in the studio? You invited us, duh. Okay, I get it. Thanks. Nice. And you feel fears. Okay. Bye. But Whatever, so just be quiet. <clears throat> Sorry for that. So, yeah. Feel the fears, right? Like, I thought I had a fear of height. Yes, height. But then I finally decided to go zip lining. Zip lining. What is your problem? Just come down here and stop. <sighs> yeah, the zip lining. And it was really fun to come to mind to it for a while, but that's beside the point. Anyway, fill up yours. So, what your fear is of. Um, we're in the same shoes as that weirdo. Cage with all the lights in here. <sighs> Or whether your fear is just about starting a course. Oh, you don't want to say anything about that, huh? Yeah, you guys are not entrepreneurs. Anyway, yeah. Your fear could be a starting a course. Or a business. Hmm, they're quiet now. Oh, oh they're quiet. Let's get to it. I'm going to help you walk through your fears because, huh, I have fears too. Alright. Let's go. Okay, and I'm back. I mean, come on. Fear is kind of crazy when you think about it. Because, I mean, hey, what is the opposite of fear? And now I'm going to go to the answer and you didn't. They take a lesson on you and come down from there. Why is it up there? <sighs> anyway, yeah, the opposite of fear is faith. So, have faith in yourself, in your product, and in whatever you're doing. If you have fear that you're going to fail this test, which I can relate, I had to take my midterm finals, um, not last semester, but you know what I'm talking about. If you're in middle school or high school or even college, then you know about the finals and all that stuff. So, I took those, and the math one, I was really afraid that I would fail it. Or not fail it, but like get a bad grade on it. So I study so hard. And, uh, oh, yeah, I know that I did not fail. Or, here's what I got in that. I got a, a C. But for me, math, which, I mean, math, but for me, in math, that's actually a very good grade. I think, well, I have to math. But, yeah. Anyway, you know, if that fear is that you're afraid of, uh, like they've all mentioned, what do you say? Uh, height. Oh, sorry. Thanks. Heights, spiders, darkness. Um, I don't know what you guys say. Dark? What you say? Oh, yeah. Dark. Or dark. It's not proper grammar. Darkness? Yeah. <laughs> darkness? What's your problem? Anyway, they're still here because, you know, I told them I should probably take a lesson about fear. Yeah. Like, come on. Fear, it's not really that big of a deal when you break it down and you think about it. Like for me, I was afraid of, you know, like I said, heights and bugs and stuff. I've overcome those fears by like from time. And I'll have you know, if you know me, you know that I still can't stand bugs. Don't let me around them. But it's not like a fear anymore. Like when I used to see bugs in my room or anywhere pretty much dead or alive. I would always, you know, see them, and I would jump, and I'd be like, oh my gosh, I was racing there, if I can kill it, or I just leave it, because I'm like, oh, I'm not doing that, and now, like, example, look like example, you know, I just found a spider about, like, I don't know, it was, it was small, but, you know, it was that small, kind of big, from where he was, I'm like, what are you doing there, 
but it's not even true. But when my curtains and heels on the window, and you guys know that I keep the window closed because I don't want bugs in my room. Not a fear, just a bear. So you know, he was there, and I saw him like over my curtains, and I was like, "What is he doing?" But it's the same spider that I had, well, I thought I killed like the week before. Well, it was like two days before, but whatever. Long story short, I killed him, and I was all shaken. I was like, "Whatever, smush toilet." So, I'm not afraid of bugs. Fear can be a lot of different things. It can come in all shapes and sizes. Like all of us said today, you know, fear of heights, spiders, darkness, fire, all that stuff. It can come in any shape and size. And uh, you don't have to accept it, you know? Because I have overcome quite a few of my fears. Like, honestly, I started this YouTube channel was actually a fear of mine. If I knew I wanted to do it, I was kind of afraid to do it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video.